the state rests its case in the trial of Punta Police Chief, who faces culpable negligence charges in the shooting death of a 73-year-old woman during a citizen's training exercise. It is now the defense's turn to pick apart the case the prosecution has built against the police chief. ABC 7's Christopher Brantley has more on today's testimony. Good evening. On Wednesday, the defense asked the judge to acquit Chief Tom Lewis. But the judge denied that request, preferring to leave the judgment up to the jury instead. Gene Sims is a firearm instructor with 38 years of experience. Among the things he said, a live firearm should never have been used during the training scenario. It is uh, a dangerous item and it should never be pointed at uh, people. Sims was brought in to help investigate the shooting of August 9th last year. Officer Lee Cole was participating in a shoot don't shoot training scenario. As we know now, his firearm was loaded with real bullets rather than blanks. Can you tell what kind of ammunition that is? <coughs> yes, ma'am. Sims described the blank bullet as a bronze color. The real bullet Very used, grass. a wad cutter, is a silver color. By looking there again at the open end of the casing, I can see a lead projectile. The prosecution argued if Chief Tom Lewis had assigned a safety officer, they would have seen a bronze bullet, and that, according to the prosecution, should have raised an alarm. Who did he designate checking Lee Cole's firearm to? I do not know. Could you ever make a conclusion after reading all of the command staff statements? No. Later in the day, the investigator from the Florida Department of Law Enforcement also testified. The jury was able to hear an audio recording of Chief Lewis taken only shortly after the shooting. In that audio recording, Chief Lewis said he was involved with organizing the event, but wasn't sure if anyone checked Officer Lee Cole's firearm prior to the scenario beginning. Sims will be back on the stand on Thursday to continue answering questions. We still do not know if Chief Lewis will take the stand in his own defense. In Punta Gorda, Christopher Brantley, ABC 7, your Suncoast News. Christopher, thank you.